story goes, little hope of bigger dreams. Hey, Smart Bros, it's me, Gina Marie, and in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my top five favorite deep conditioners, like my ultimate top five favorite deep conditioners. As you guys know, I feel like deep conditioners are like the most important part of a hair regimen. And I feel like out of all the products that I have, I go through deep conditioners the fastest. I'm more willing to try deep conditioners. And I have came across some amazing, amazing deep conditioners. But a lot of you guys want to know like, what is my ultimate favorite deep conditioners? And so I do have a video on my top 10 favorite deep conditioners where it's like a little bit of mix of expensive deep conditioners, a little bit of mix of inexpensive deep conditioners, but I narrowed it down to five. And when I tell you guys, this was extremely hard to do. It was extremely hard to do, but I narrowed it down to five. All these products you have heard me talk about on my channel before as well. And so, yeah, before we get into this video, if you have not subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit the subscription button as well as the notification button and join our SmartFlow family. So let's talk about my top five deep conditions. So because I already had trouble narrowing it down to five, I'm not going to even do it, my, do this to myself by trying to actually rank them because it would literally, literally be physically impossible for me to rank them because depending on what my hair needs, I might like one deep conditioner more than the other one for that week. And then another week, it's just completely different. And so that's why I'm not going to rank them. But these are definitely, hands down, my favorite deep conditioners that I will always repurchase because I absolutely love them. So the very first deep conditioner I'm going to talk about, I actually don't have it with me. So I wanted to go ahead and knock that one out. And it is the Camille Rose Algae Renew Deep Conditioner. This hands down is a amazing deep conditioner. It's like a perfect balance of moisture and protein for me, but I definitely get more of a moisture feel when it comes to that deep conditioner. And I'm a little upset because I don't have it. I opted out and tried their new deep conditioner that they released, which I have a video on if you wanna check that out. And I, while I did like that deep conditioner, I just still like the Algae Renew deep conditioner better and so I'm gonna finish that one but I'm, I'm just gonna go back to my Algae Renew from Camille Rose that is like hands down a great deep conditioner and is still my favorite deep conditioner from Camille Rose that I will definitely always repurchase and then the next deep conditioner that I have is from Soul Tanical Afro Tastic Curl Elastic Deep Conditioner Retreatment. I Got this one from Black Friday yesterday. I ended up getting two by accident, but when I first tried this, I was so glad that I had two because this stuff is so amazing that I think they do leader sales at Soul Tanical that I think I'm just going to buy the leader of this because I really, truly enjoy this deep condition. The slip the moisture, my curls always, like if I feel like my curls are not looking as strong as they normally are, I use this one and I can just see the elasticity come back to my curls and I absolutely love this deep conditioner. Another great deep conditioner that is in my top five, you guys already know, it's gonna be the Algebra Beauty Bio Mint Deep, Con deep Conditioning Treatment. I do have a solid one review on this deep conditioner. I love this deep conditioner because it is everything and my hair, it just literally melts into my hair. All my tangles just go away without minimal effort. Don't need to take a brush through my hair to get rid of my tangles or anything like that. I just absolutely love this deep conditioner because it has bio mint, the mint in it. It gives you this refreshing feel when you put it on your hair that I just love. It just, I just feel like I'm in a spa or something like that. Like my hair is getting a spa treatment when I use this product. It does contain wheat protein, so I don't use this every single week just because I, I don't know if I'm protein sensitive or anything, but I also don't want to take the chance. But I absolutely love this deep conditioner. It is absolutely amazing and I'm so glad y'all guys told me to try this company because it's everything. 
So the next one, which will be number four, will be the Allocate Naturals Honey and Sage Deep Conditioner. This is another deep conditioner that has been with me from the very beginning. So Camille Rose and this deep conditioner was definitely one of those first deep conditioners that I tried going natural. And out of all the deep conditioners that I've tried, the Camille Rose and this one have always stood their ground. They have not gotten beat out by other deep conditioners that I try and they're absolutely amazing. I haven't cracked this one open yet because I was trying to get rid of some of them, but I'm so glad that I've gotten rid of a lot of deep conditioners that I can finally open this bad boy and start using it because I absolutely love this deep conditioner. It herbs and things in it that you know when you think of that hair mayonnaise that you used to do back in the gap that we used to use. That's what it have, but it just soaks in. The moisture you get, this is just straight moisture packed product that will live, leave your hair feeling so good, shiny. Absolutely love this little bottle of deep conditioner. And then my last deep conditioner is from the Obia Naturals and it is their Babasu Deep Conditioner. Another great moisturizing deep conditioner. This is absolutely protein free. They another great deep conditioner. I highly recommend this deep conditioner if you are type four, more on the kinkier side. This deep conditioner is great, full of moisture. And I feel like even though it's an eight ounce bottle, I feel like I get a lot more uses from this deep conditioners than I do all my other eight ounce bottles. So I do love that. Love that about this product. It's very thick in texture and it's just amazing. So yeah, those are my top five favorite deep conditioner of all times, at least as of right now. Um, I just, those are products that I just haven't, while I have tried some other really great deep conditioner, they just haven't broke that top five. And so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to thumbs it up. Let me know what are your favorite deep conditioners down below in the description box. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. So you really made it to the end of the video. You the real MVP. But because you made it to the end of the video, I know you like my content. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my other uploads. Also, make sure you check out these other two videos that I posted on my channel. And thank you guys so much for watching.